Tonight, a Henderson woman is bringing some light to her neighborhood this holiday season, but she's hoping her Christmas display, you see right here, will reach far beyond her front yard. 13 Action News reporter Annalise Ortiz shares this touching story. At the end of a dark neighborhood, you'll find the twinkling lights. Whoa! Step into the winter wonderland and Santa brings some delight. Christmas Town is a happy place. A surprise at every corner makes for a magical night. <laughs> but if you look even closer, you'll see the most touching surprise of all, an opportunity to sign a quilt, which will be given to those who need to heal from what happened to our community on October 1st. One of those people in need of healing is Irina Bell's son, who was on the strip when the nightmare began. He says, Mom, please take the visions out of my head, please. And as a mom, I wanted to. But I couldn't. So this is her way of helping. She's asking people who stop by the Christmas display near Heritage Park in Henderson to leave words of encouragement on the quilts. If this is a way it can heal them just for a moment in time, then I've done my job. These quilts will go to victims and survivors of the shooting. She's even made one for each local news station. We need as a community to say thank you to each and every one of these journalists. Within the display is a memorial for those who died. 58 stars, 58 families whose holiday season will be less bright this year. When crowds are drawn to these twinkling lights, Bell hopes they'll be reminded of the brightness that always emerges from the dark. It makes your heart want to like just pop. Annalise Ortiz, 13 Action News. That's How about great. that? Great that's story. Thank you. What a beautiful yeah, thing to do. Yeah, Vegas strong. That's right. There's another example of it.